Howdy, and welcome back to the Texas Bucket List Bite of the Season Special. We are almost to our top spot, but first, our second favorite stop of the fall, a barbecue joint in Houston named Henderson and Kane. In the historic Sixth Ward of Houston, you'll find this neighborhood store attracting all sorts of customers. That includes furry friends just looking for someone to throw them a bone. I've never known more dogs and people in one neighborhood in my life. The bulldog is a sight to see, man. He's, he's a big guy. <laughs> You'll see him, and he'll just stop, and he won't move until he gets a treat. <laughs> this is the place to sit. Veronica Avila, her brother Jesse, and her husband John started this small business in 2018 and have already cooked up quite the reputation. Some of the best brisket, if, if you've ever had it. Super good. Breakfast tacos, barbecue, and baked goods. I mean. It's the trifecta. Yeah, for sure. And coffee. Veronica's grandparents owned a restaurant in El Paso. John's owned a tamale and barbecue joint in Bryan. Um, when I walk in and I smell the brisket, in my mind I'm not smelling brisket, but I'm smelling my grandfather's old place in Bryan, Texas. And to me, that's like good for the soul. Well, I was ready for a sample, and Veronica suggested something sizable. We call our five meat plate the pit master. The pit master? I think we're gonna do the pitmaster. All right, sounds good to me. I mean, why not? <laughs> five for five. Mm. Well, what are we gonna start with? Let's we'll start with the smoked prime Angus brisket. Gosh. We smoke for about 24 hours. That is beautiful. Then comes the pulled pork. Oh yeah, I gotta throw a thick piece on there. Yeah, there you go. I'm just now realizing we're gonna fill up this whole tray. We are. Oh boy. All right, now Jesse's handing off the ribs. Yeah, we've got some pork ribs here. We finish things out with some sausage and turkey. Oh. Look at that. So here we are at the Henderson and Kane General Store with a barbecue platter, brisket, pulled pork, ribs, sausage, turkey, and all sorts of sides. So we're gonna start with uh, the brisket because that's usually the star of the show, but it might not be here. They all might be stars. Smells amazing, looks amazing, cooked amazing, smoked amazing. How many more amazings can there be? Tastes amazing. All those spices come together to make a really good traditional barbecue flavor. The brisket is just like so moist and just like pulls apart. From the brisket, we're gonna go to the pulled pork. Get some big chunks, some little chunks, and some shreddage. Ain't no reason to put lipstick on this pig. Just go ahead and eat it. It's kind of extremely hard to resist. Brisket's amazing, pulled pork's amazing, the ribs are amazing, the sausage. Amazing. Out of one out of 10, it's like 11. 12. And finally, we have the turkey. Uh, if we keep along the path we've been on, there should be uh, no doubt that this is amazing. That is some good gobbler. Uh, there's Texas barbecue, and then there's really great Texas barbecue, and, and they've got it. Um, they've got it nailed. Well, if you're a little piggy that needs to go to the market for some bodacious barbecue and you happen to be in Houston, Henderson and Kane is well worth a stop on the Texas bucket list. I take a stroll through the old Sixth Ward, you know, step in with some barbecue and a little a pint in, on your way in or out. They've just done such a great job, not only, you know, embracing, you know, making a real fine menu and a real good quality of food, but also being wonderful, endearing people and being interested in the community that they run their business in. We're proud in Texas. Um, anytime there's something to be proud of, we love letting the world know, and Texas barbecue is definitely one of those things that I think is the best in the world. Thank you.